In this video, I will show you how to browse the internet on your Sony TV. Now, over here I have the Sony Bravia Google TV, but it doesn't matter the type of Sony TV you have. Following similar steps, you should be able to browse the internet on any Sony TV you have, whether it's the Sony Bravia Android TV or the old Sony Bravia TV. And to do this, first things first, you want to make sure that your Sony TV is actually connected to the internet. And once that is done, you want to go ahead and look for the internet browser app on your Sony TV. Now, most Sony TV actually comes with their own pre-installed internet browser, but some does not come with a browser. So for instance, the Sony Bravia Google TV over here actually comes with its own browser. So if you come over to this list of apps, you're going to see the internet browser app over here on the TV. So you can go ahead and use this particular browser. And in case your Sony TV does not have this internet browser pre-installed with the TV, you don't have to worry. I'm also going to show you how to download and install a very compatible and user-friendly browser you can can use on your sony tv and browse the internet if your own sony tv actually comes with a pre-installed internet browser you can go ahead and open up this browser and this is basically how it looks like once you first launch it click on the accept and you basically have this nice looking browser now from here you can come over to the top using your cursor you can control the cursor with your remote control and then search for whatever you want to search on the internet this browser actually works pretty well and google is actually its default search engine you can literally see this is basically the result from google's search results but in case you do not have this particular browser on your sony tv or you're using the sony bravia android tv that does not have this browser pre-installed what you can actually do is to head over to the app store of your sony tv so go ahead and open up the google play store or just come over to this search icon in the app section of your sony tv if you're using the sony google tv then go ahead and search for tv bro now the tv bro browser is actually one of the most popular browsers you can actually find on the google play store and it's available for both your sony bravia google tv and your sony bravia android tv or just any sony tv you have go ahead and click on the search icon to search for the tv bro browser and from the google play store you should be able to find this tv bro browser over here go ahead and click on it to open up the browser and from here you can now install the tv bro browser into your tv and once the TV Bro browser is downloaded and installed, you can go ahead and open it up directly from here. Now, this TV Bro browser is so powerful that it has almost everything you would get on popular browsers like the Google Chrome and Firefox browser. Over here, you have the inputs field where you can actually just go ahead and search for any URL you want on your TV. So I can go ahead and search for any text or URL. I can just go ahead and search for Facebook over here and it automatically gives me Facebook from Google search results. So basically this is how it works and it uses Google as its default search engine. This browser also has a lot of other interesting features. For instance, it has the voice mode where you can actually browse using your voice. It also enables you to track your history from this particular option. There is also the bookmark feature here you find all of your downloads and there is also the incognito mode which is also an interesting one if you want to browse privately on your TV. From the home of the browser, you actually have some default websites you can actually visit. For instance, you can set the Facebook website, YouTube, Netflix and other websites you can actually visit from the home page over here. So basically, this particular browser is enough to give you everything you want if you want to browse the internet on your Sony TV. Especially if your Sony TV does not have the pre-installed browser that comes with the TV. If you find this video useful, please make sure you smash the like button and subscribe to this YouTube channel for more interesting tech tips like this one.